Roblox Stores has been around for quite a bit of weeks, and of course, like any new game, it does have their own share of huge bugs. We'll be going over 8 game-breaking glitches in Roblox Stores in this one, so make sure you comment your favorite ones down below, and let's get this party started. Number 1, Glitchy Glitch. Now most of us probably have already encountered the entity called Glitch. He usually shows up in multiple servers and if you're running behind of the group quite a bit, you'll randomly turn around to a big jump scare of him as he teleports you back, taking your health in the process. Another more rare use for Glitch though is that he acts as a fail safe mechanic. Basically, that means if for some reason the next room is unable to load, he will actually teleport you past that room, allowing you to skip it completely without taking your health in this scenario. It's how you can still encounter him even if you play in a server all by yourself. But what happens if Glitch suddenly becomes super glitchy? Uh, this could happen. The door will not be able to open and if Glitch is for some reason sleeping on the job, he is not able to teleport you past this unloaded room which will make you stuck in the game. Now this is an extremely rare occurrence but it can happen at any point during the server especially if something went wrong with the game's code causing a room not to load. So hopefully Glitch works for you. Number 2 Seek Chase Another big staple of Roblox doors is the big seek chase that happens around doors 30 to 40 and 80 to 90 as you run away from this big fellow right here. The sequence itself isn't really prone to bugs as it's been made very well, but at the end, instead of going through the door, hide in one of the corners still inside the hallway and you'll see Seek go up to the door and suddenly run backwards. If you really wanted to, you could use some vitamins and touch them, so congratulations! I guess that makes you Seek now. Inside the Seek hallway though, not only can you loot extra gold and items in here, but the previous rooms do disappear loading the game quicker and a void is present. If you fall through the void, you can find some of those floating hands and lanterns from the previous section and most times, it will teleport you back to the next room. There has been times where people reported not being able to respawn after falling off of this ledge, but that just may be a very rare occurrence. Number 3, Super Speed. Well, if you ever wanted to know how you could be as fast as Sonic the Hedgehog in yeah, Roblox so. doors, this is it. Everyone knows that if other players are ahead of you, the game automatically makes you run faster in order to catch up. But there used to be a big glitch a couple of weeks ago where if you joined into a server with a friend a couple doors ahead and if he randomly quits and leaves the server, the player in the back will be granted with an internal speed boost that would work for the rest of the game. And yes, if you do take those vitamins for those healthy bones, you will be able to run even faster, being able to achieve the maximum running speed the game will let you. Now it's unknown whether or not the speed glitch would be reset during the seek chase, as there's no footage of this happening, but this glitch ended up getting patched recently, so you can't really do this one anymore. Sorry Sonic. Number 4, Infinite Lighter. Yes, I know those dark rooms can get very annoying, especially when you have entities such as Screech constantly pestering you and even attacking you as well, but this glitch was definitely an OP one. In order to do the infinite lighter glitch, you had to have less than half of the maximum fuel in order to create a longer animation, usually resulting in several spark attempts. On the first spark animation frame, if the player unequips the lighter and quickly picks it back up, it will confuse the game and glitch the lighter, allowing it to work infinitely without using any fuel. Unfortunately, this could not have been done with the flashlight as its starting animation is nearly impossible to time. And also this glitch would have been able to light up rooms, but Screech would still spawn and generally become a nuisance. Perhaps the worst of all though, this glitch was also patched several weeks ago, so players are not able to replicate this anymore. Number 5, Door 100. 
As you complete all of the rooms in the entire hotel, you will be standing right before the last room in the entire building known as Door 100. Here you will encounter the familiar figure during one of his last cutscenes, but instead of running away and hiding, you know there's an easier way to trick and glitch in order to get past him. This is a growing glitch, but players are actually able to cut right underneath the entity in order to get to the staircase towards the elevator. And while you're chilling up here, Figure will be so confused as he loops his walking animation from the back of the room to the front. Looks like he's not able to use the staircases, which is fortunate for you. Unfortunately though, you do have to have a good plan on how to get out of this predicament because you may just be trapped in there for good since you need to get to the elevator switch. Number 6, Figure again? Yeah, who knew Figure had so many moments, especially when it comes to glitches? But as you roam around the library looking for those books and codes for that lock, many players have experienced random glitch moments, such as Karen catching Figure getting his hand stuck inside a closet and supposedly going after another player. With the entity stuck in this position, he is unable to free himself, which should make the level super easy. Way to take one for the team, THZ! Not only that though, Figure was also found being stuck on the pillars of the library as shown here by one fox. It's kinda like Figure decided to put super glue on his hands and get stuck to everything he touches, huh? This one I can't really explain, but I think you're starting to get the point behind this. Maybe he's doing the crab walk though. If so, he's doing a great job at it. Number 7, Bed Glitching. So tell me, how many of you folks have ever even head underneath a bed before in Roblox doors? Not going to lie, I used to when I was younger, but it seems that these beds are one of the most useless features in the game, but it's super useful of course when it comes to glitches. Firstly, you can crawl underneath the bed and be able to see outside the map, which is pretty interesting by itself, but most notably, it can be possible to glitch through the floor to the void, though you'll only be teleported back to the same room again. Number 8, Trapped Hotel. Of course, the whole nature of the game is to progress through the hotel thanks to usable opening doors, but how could you explain this? A randomly generated room that features two boarded up doors that cannot be opened. The room even trolls you by playing the door opening sound effect, but nothing happens at all. You might as well say that it's game over and restart while you're at it. But there is a way to get past this and beat the game. If you like and subscribe, especially with more doors content coming your way.